This video is going to be very useful for planning engineers. Whether they are freshers, experienced or switching a job to another company for their career growth. Hello, my name is Mohammad Azharuddin, senior planning engineer and you are watching my YouTube channel Azhar Technical Zone. If you have not subscribed my channel, please go and subscribe. So in this video, I will tell you about the most important and 100% askable questions in planning interviews from freshers to experience level. I can assure you after watching this video, you will be able to crack any planning engineer interviews in your future. So let's get start. The first question in an interview which they will ask the year of experience in planning, especially in oil and gas industry or in your construction industry. So you can answer this question based on your experience, whether you are fresher or experienced person. Next, moving to second question, expense with Adnoc. If you have worked with Adnoc or another other companies, so you can answer with this question. The third question will be the what kind of project you have done. So if you have done any projects in your experience previously in your organization, so you can answer this question and project faces here. You can uh, any interviewer or any employer can ask this question project faces just in brief i will tell you what are the project faces initially initiation planning execution planning and control and project close out so this will be answer of this project faces so in this video just i am going to tell you about the questions which they may ask and fifth one any idea about the types of the projects so what are the types of the projects whether call off or lump sum or you can say fixed price projects. So this question is called as a what type of projects you have done in your previous industry. They may ask this question. Next question. What is planning package and what are the documents required in preparation of the planning package? They may ask this question. Then moving forward. What is baseline schedule? What do you mean by resources? What is schedule? variance and its formula they may ask formula also of schedule variance as we know schedule variance formula is the difference between actual and plan what is the main driver of the project and how will you get it which one is the best schedule they may ask this question then structure of the project schedule structure of the project schedule means how you are going to structure a project so you can answer by the WBS like first primary activities, then procurement, yeah, then engineering, then procurement, then construction, then installation, then testing and commissioning, then project closeout. So this will be an answer of this structure of project schedule. What is critical activity? What is free float, total float and slack? What is lag and lead in the project schedule? What is a fast tracking and crash crashing technique in Primavera P6 or MS project and do you have any about idea about the constraints means the project constraints they are asking in this one like uh, must start on must finish on as early as, as possible as finish as, as possible these are the constraints okay you can go and check this uh, answer in on Google also how to measure the progress manpower histogram and yes curve deliverables so they may ask what is manpower histogram yes curve and deliverables how to measure the progress of deliverables so with the help of milestones of the percentage we can measure the deliverables you can go and check out my videos which i have which i have uploaded previously any idea about the eot doc documents what is eot eot means extension of time which we will claim if our project delays against the baseline what is com means what is koem koem means kickoff meeting which will be a first meeting of the project after awarding the project to the contractor and they may ask do you have any about the progress review meeting which may call as progress review meeting prm what is spi and cpi schedule performance index and cost performance index these are the tools and techniques which you can measure the progress what is forecast? What is progress tracker? What are the scheduling softwares to measure the progress? What is 
Primavera and MS Project. How well expert you are in Excel. So Excel is also very important uh, in the field of project management, which you can do lot of things in Excel softwares. Any idea about PPC and invoicing? PPC is also called as project payment certificate. Uh, what is costing? What is project controlling? What is WBS? Difference in planning and scheduling engineers. So what is the main core difference between the planning and scheduling engineer? What are the key, sorry, what are the key main points to complete the project on time? What are the factors which you can complete the project on time? So you can uh, explain here like uh, quality is there, time is there and your deliverables are there. You can answer in this way. How many baselines allowed in MS projects? What is calendar? What is calendar or project calendar? What is productivity? As we know, productivity is defined as the ratio of output to the input means how much you are giving input to get your output so this is a basic formula uh, which you can use and they may ask do you have any idea about the weightages and stages of execution of project and what is the early and late plan and what is the revise and recovery plan of the projects so these are the questions uh, last one but not the least one but if i receive the thousand views on this video so definitely i will go uh, in depth uh, to make a video on this one so hope this one will be very useful for you people thank you please subscribe my channel and don't forget to press the bell icon thank you till next video